by the end of this video you will be able to understand and know more about the concept of environmental accounting. Environmental Accounting Environmental accounting aims at achieving sustainable development, maintaining a favorable relationship with the community and pursuing effective and efficient environmental conservation activity. This accounting procedure allows a company to identify the cost of environmental conservation during the normal course of business, identify benefits gained from such activities, provides the best possible means of quantitative measurements in monetary value or physical units and supports the communication of its results. Environmental conservation. Environmental conservation is defined as the prevention, reduction and avoidance of environmental impact, removal of such impact, restoration following the occurrence of a disaster and other activities. The environmental impacts are the burden on the environment from the business operations or other human activities and potential obstacles which may hinder the preservation of a favorable environment. Necessity of environmental accounting A company or other organization can accurately identify and measure the investment and costs relating to environmental conservation activities. By having better insights into the potential benefits of these investments and cost, the company can not only improve the efficiency of its activities, but environmental accounting also plays a very important role in supporting decision making. Companies and other organizations are required to have accountability to stakeholders such as consumers, business partners, investors, employees, locals, residents and administration when utilizing environmental resources that is public goods for their business activities. Environmental accounting helps companies and other organizations to boost their public trust and confidence. Functions and role of environmental accounting. Environmental accounting has two major functions. One is internal functions and the external functions. Internal function includes functions as a business management tool for uh, used by the managers and related business units. External function includes communication for the community. Environmental conservation cost categories. So these are the key categories like business area cost, upstream or downstream cost, administration cost, research and development cost, uh, social activity cost, environmental remediation cost, and other cost. Business area cost prominently includes global environmental conservation cost and resource recycling cost. Cost for prevention, preventing the air pollution, cost for preventing water pollution, cost for preventing noise pollution. So the cost which is involved in the prevention of various pollution related activities of an organization. Global environmental conservation cost includes cost for preventing the global warming, cost for preventing the ozone depletion and cost for other global environmental conservation activities. The issues like global warming and ozone depletion are discussed and dealt at the global level. That's why we call them the global environmental conservation cost. Next one is the resource circulation cost. It includes cost for recycling other industrial waste then cost for recycling the municipal waste, cost for disposal of the industrial waste. So here, when we talk about 3R mantra, like reduce, recycle and reuse. So all the costs relating to those R mantras relating to resource circulation cost. Next is administration cost. The cost involved in environmental training of the employees of an organization. Cost for environmental improvement activities such as natural conservation, greening, beautification and landscape preservation uh, at or in the vicinity of the business sites. So all the cost which is involved in terms of training the people, uh, employees or different stakeholders includes in the administration cost. 
Social activity cost includes if an organization is involved is involved in various social activities. So that cost we call as a social activity cost. Cost for environmental improvement activities including uh, nature conservation, planting of greenery, beautification, and landscaping uh, preservation, with exception of the business sites. Environmental remediation cost. Environmental remediation costs are allocated for recovery of the environmental degradation due to business activities which includes cost to restore the natural environmental back to its uh, original state provision of the insurance fees to cover degradation to the environment all these accounting procedures and costs which allows a company to identify the cost of environmental conservation during the normal course of business Identify benefits gained from such activities, provide the best possible means of quantitative measurements in monetary values or physical units, and support the communication of its results. I'm sure you must have found this video useful and informative. If so, then please give a thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Uh, I'll see you guys in my next video. Until then, this is Sandeep signing off. Thank you for your time.